Today we're reviewing Profoto's new A1 Flash. We're stoked to be doing it because it's a total game changer for wedding photographers. Um, right now it's available for pre-order in the US and it costs $1,000. Two things before we start. One, this is a sort of bias review because Profoto flew us out to Sweden to their headquarters and they gave us two free flashes, what they call the world's smallest studio light. However, they didn't ask us to make a video and they don't even know that we're doing this. We're just really stoked on these as wedding photographers. The second thing is this flash is not for everyone. If you're a professional wedding photographer, if you shoot high pressure, high end commercial work, or you already have a lot of Profoto gear, and this is definitely a game changer. If you're not, there are plenty of other cheaper options, so stop watching this video, give us a thumbs up, and just move on. First things first, this isn't a super technical review of the A1. Instead, we'll talk more about what we like about some of the features and how we plan on using it. One of the things that we love about the A1 is that they really focused on simplicity and ease of use. There aren't complicated menus, rather just two screens of options. Syncing multiple lights together is as easy as selecting the channel and the group. It has the air remote built in, so if you have other pro photo lights, you can use the A1 to trigger them. The A1 also comes with a dome diffuser, which is similar to our MagSphere we use with our Canon speed light. But where the MagMod system makes your flash super top heavy, the dome diffuser weighs next to nothing. It also comes with a wide lens and a bounce card, which also doubles as a flag. And there's a stand which allows you to stand a flash up or attach it to a light stand. The modeling light is a great feature which helps you place your light by seeing how the light cast affects your subject. There's also high-speed sync, which lets you fire the flash at incredibly fast shutter speeds. You can use the flash in TTL mode to set the power based on your camera settings, or use manual mode for more control. What we love most, however, is the fast recycle time. There's so many times halfway through a wedding reception when our speed lights have to take longer and longer in between flashes, and we end up missing moments like bouquet tosses due to flashes not firing. With the rechargeable battery, it has a super fast recycle time and lasts a lot longer than AA batteries. Since we tend to only use artificial light when we have to, we tested the A1 out as a subtle fill light for a couple lifestyle portraits. We wanted the flash to fill in some shadows while maintaining the natural light look that we like. We also just shot a wedding this past weekend where we got to use our A1s for clients for the first time. All in all, we're super impressed with this light and we're more than excited to replace our Canon speed lights with the A1s. So this Profoto A1 Flash is definitely a game changer for us and we can't wait to use that at our upcoming weddings. But as we said, it does come out of price and we already know it's not for everyone. You don't have to tell us that in the comments section. But go ahead and pulverize that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you next week.